Claire Pacala. She joins me now from Reims. Claire, what's the plan then? Well, the ceremony will actually be starting out in about an hour's time. Emmanuel Macron, the French president, and Ibrahim Boubacar Keita, the Malian president, will start by reviewing the troops. Um, We'll see a flag honouring ceremony as well. And then we'll hear from a French Congolese author, Alain Mabankou. He will be making a speech and follow closely behind that. We will be hearing from the Malian president. He will also be talking here where I'm standing in Reims in this park, just um, near this monument that you can see behind me, the monument celebrating, remembering um, African soldiers who fought for France, fought for the Allied powers in World War One. After Ibrahim um, Boubacar Keita speaks, we will then um, see Emmanuel Macron but and the Mali president. president. They will be laying flowers at the monument just behind mm -hmm. me. There will then be a minute of silence and then the ceremony will be closed it's with the Marseillaise, the French national anthem. Claire, why are these troops, these colonial troops, only being honoured now? Well, it, certainly this monument has a very complicated history. Now, there was an exact monument, exactly like the one just behind me, that was put in place here in Reims in 1924. Um, at the same time, an exact replica of that monument was put in place in Bamako, which is now the capital of Mali. At the time, it was the capital of French Sudan. Sudan. Now, what happened was in 1940, uh, Rantz was occupied by the Nazis and we saw German troops actually dismantled the monument, put it on a train and sent it to an unknown destination. We don't know whether it was melted down for use of the bronze metal or if it was potentially found somewhere. It was an unknown destination and no one really knows quite what happened to that original statue. Now, in the 1960s, another statue remembering African troops who fought in World War I for France. That was put up here in, this, in the city of Reims, but it was not exactly the same as the one you can see behind me. That replica was actually only put in place in 2013, so five years ago, and it's only being inaugurated today. Um, it will be inaugurated in about an hour and a half's time by the French President Emmanuel Macron and the Malian President Ibrahim Boubacar Keita. Thank you very much, Claire. Claire Bagalin reporting from Reims.